artist of all time, the great Bruce Lee, making his walk to the octagon here tonight, Jim. Everybody wants to be Bruce Lee. They say they want to be like Mike. If you're a fighter, you want it to be like Bruce Lee. You want it to be that fast. You want it to be that charismatic. You want it to have an ability to just freeze your opponents. Your speed, your movement, just the diversity in the attacks that you can give your opponents would just confuse people. I mean, I watched him beat a seven-foot to stay undefeated. Right. If you could do that, you could do anything. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once. I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times. Bruce Lee and Just so wise. Our kill of the day for this heavyweight championship fight. And now to get us started, here is Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> Referee for this one. Ready. Well, what a visual this is. Bruce Lee ready to go for round one, the founding father of modern mixed martial arts. It's hard to simulate his speed and his striking in training. And I think that's something that has been a big focus for the opponent coming in here tonight. Quick with his hands, quick with his feet, and obviously a guy who gets off to a very good start more often than not. Bruce Lee ready to go for round one. Set up that head kick again. This one does not find the hole. Nice stupid punch. Look at that great work to the body from the clinch. I might let you kick the inside of my leg after the show. No. See how that feels. You don't want that, J.A. You do not want that. No one wants that. Even trained professional fighters right. can't take too many of those strikes. It's high. Fighter lands a jab. Big knee there. Fast pace here in the early going. Good kick. Great kick. 
kick to the body. Trying to establish that jab once again. Oh, really exploiting his reach advantage as he landed the jab there, DC. We march on three minutes to go. Push kick there to the body. And that's been kicked out. It's home up top. Trying to inflict some damage here, but misses with the kick. I give one, I take one. You give one, you take one. That's how this fight is. Trying to go to the body now with the kick. That one misses. You don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. All right, well, good news is he rocked him. Bad news is he wasn't able to finish the job, and now his opponent's back in the fight. I mean, you don't get those opportunities very often. You got to take full advantage of them when they're presented to you. Nice job defensively. He blocked that punch. Solid punch. That one definitely got through. Attempts the front kick there. Side kick is there. Oh, nice punch there in the clinch. Oh. There's the kick, it's blocked. And that's, that's the danger in the engagement there. Under a minute now to go in the round. Overhand right, swing and a miss. Good punch. Kick there by Lee. 20 seconds left. Throws a big right hand, but doesn't find its home. Oh, heavy kick downstairs. Oh, big knee to the body. Man alive. Outstanding round, and another five minutes coming up. Sit down. Take a deep breath. Now listen, you probably lost that round. The only reason we lost it is because you're waiting on him. I need you to be first. All right, a lot of high-level highlights from that last round, DC. Take us through the replay. If he fought like this, I would be comfortable entering him into a K-1 level right? kickboxing competition. He's that good at finding and landing those kicks at will. He needs to continue to do this as the fight goes on. You ready to fight? Ready. Round two underway. All right, this should be good as our next round gets underway. We nearly had a knockout in the previous round, but the corner seems to think they have their fight. Oh, not the accuracy to land right there. His opponent's wobble chin. He's hurt bad. He cannot take another shot like that. Oh, my goodness. starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Oh, now gets an underhook to get a more dominant position. Oh, 
All right, so now we start to see some redness underneath the elbow. You got to think he's going to continue to attack the body with all of his strengths. Well, his opponent has not done anything to deter him. He should keep doing this, keep going to the well until his opponent finds an answer because right now he seems lost to him. Nice job to land the straight punch there. Must be nice to have that kind of reach advantage, DC. I know you can't necessarily relate. Oh, and this is why you pay to be in the building. Back and forth we go. Hands up. Work, guys. Oh, good head movement there. Nice slip. Misses with the left hook. Three minutes and change to go in round two. He does a great job of getting that leg kick to the target. Misses with the right hand. Well, he's really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive now here and starting to find himself in the pocket. Back to the leg kick now. That one's no good. Looks as though he's dealing with a cut above the eye here. Nice work, guys. Nice display of technique by him there on the sidekick. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. Very traditional technique that a lot of guys are using now in the UFC. Man, look at the redness now almost immediately on the right side of his body. Nice block. Big knee. Under two minutes to go. Lee's now switching his stance. Strong, straight left there. This pace is just absurd. He has kept it up throughout the fight. Shades of Max Holloway against Calvin Cater. Punches and punches. I mean, being there, watching Max Holloway do what he did was super impressive. So to even list his performance alongside that tells you how this guy is fighting tonight. Lee's bleeding from the mouth, Daniel. Looks as though there's a cut on his lip. Thankfully, he's a lot tougher than I am. Throwing that jab now again. The fighter evades. Back and forth we go. Sidekick lands for him there, champ. A lot of times that is used to manage space. Oh, what a connection by him there. His opponent could be out of here soon, DC. He's almost done. on his first test in elementary school. Nice job by him to get the knee to the target there, using his length exceptionally well tonight. Oh, he just continues to pour it on. He has been aggressive all night long with his striking. Got to be careful here to not empty the gas tank. So far, so good, though, in this round. Big elbow there, Lance. Ten seconds to go in the round. Two rounds in the books. All right, so that round is in the books. Lee's corner now. We'll take a look at that lip. The cut man is in, and you got to tighten that up. It's really starting to bleed now. We'll see if uh, it rears its ugly head as this fight continues. All right, so there's the horn signifying the end of the round. We had a knockdown there, but not a knockout. No, it wasn't a knockout, but you can't take those shots. That big punch landed, and it sat him down. If he gets hit with another one of those, it might be good night, Irene. You ready? You ready? 
Here we go, third round of this championship fight. Well, not only has he stayed in the biggest shots of fight thus far, how's his opponent still standing? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. It might not be over now, but it's got to be over very soon. Oh, nice high kick. Leg kick checked effectively there by Lee. Another beautiful body shot there. You see the damage starting to accumulate. Maybe some defense would be wise at this point in the fight. I think so, John. You can't just get beat up to the body. It doesn't show itself right away. It takes time whenever you're beating somebody up from the body and working your way up to the head. The right Huge connection by him there. He needs to get on his bicycle, John. He must be in this so that he does get finished. Oh, nice body shot. Big right hand there. Oh, it's oh, 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 he got hit again. Oh, nice job defensively there to get the guard up. Shot is blocked by Lee. Well, it's been a wild fight thus far. Perhaps a contender for some bonus money at fight's end. These guys are going to have to dig deep. They're both hurt. They're both hurt. You expected it. You expected a close fight. You did not expect a war like this, though, where both guys, from the moment they said fight, went forward, got in each other's face, and just beat each other up. It's been tremendous. Oh, nice. Under three minutes to go in our third round. Oh, roundhouse kick. Style points on that one. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively protecting the head and sort of maybe letting his opponent gas out a little bit with all the volume. His opponent sees the target, but he can't get to the target. So he'll continue to throw, and he'll continue to wear on his own gas tank. Well, not sure if he's lighter on his feet or what it is, but these last couple of rounds, he's been far more aggressive, a lot more pressure. Oh, he's really starting to light him up now. Back to the jab now, no good. Real nice body kick lands. Well, he is clearly faded in this one, and I'm not talking about the high and tight skin fade on my man Daniel oh. Cormier. He got stunned earlier in the round, and, and mentally I feel like he checked out a little bit. He hasn't been able to build back the fight the way that we're used to seeing him fight. He needs to take a breath, take a moment, and get back to work. Big shot to the head. All right, so a knockdown for him in the previous round, and you can just see by his body language how confident he is in the striking realm in this matchup. And you can see his confidence in his posture, but also you can see the effect that knockdown had on his opponent by the way he is approaching this fight. Great setup. That was a nasty high kick. So wisely, he continues to attack that area that is cut wide open. When you were fighting, was that something you would do? You see a cut track. Oh, he's hurt. Oh! Big, straight left. And now leather being thrown on both sides. Oh, good knee. All right, good job by him there to raise the guard and protect his head. He's doing a good job of keeping the guard high, blocking his head, making sure he's not taking those damaging strikes up top. All right, 45 seconds now to go on the round. Ooh, looking to go to the leg kick here, just out of range. Final 30 seconds of this third round. Oh, a huge strike lands there, DC. He landed that massive shot. Now he needs to try to find the next shot, the follow-up shot that will finish the fight. 15 seconds. It's work. He's in a ton of trouble right now. 
Oh, he lands oh. a massive kick here. That's three rounds. We're now headed to the championship rounds. All right, so there's the end of the round. You see the blood trickling down as he makes his way back to the stool. Cut on the bridge of the nose, or so it appears from the strike in that round. Cut man getting right to work. All right, well, the cut man has got his work cut out for him, and I believe we have isolated the shot that caused that critical cut above the eye. I mean, right above the eye, John. Too many damaging blows. He's got to change something because now every time he gets hit above the eye, the blood will start to leak in his eye, making it almost impossible to fight. You ready to fight? Ready. Go. All right, here is round four. Fight scheduled for five five-minute rounds. All right, so here we go. Fourth round is underway. What is the fighter's mentality when you enter those seminal championship rounds? You understand that you are getting close now. The night is almost over. The goal is within reach now. 15 minutes down, 10 to go. You tell yourself you can do anything for 10 minutes. All right, seems as though his sole focus is attacking that cut. And man, it's getting bad now. A lot of blood flowing. Yeah, as it should be. Well, he should be focused on getting to that cut making his opponent pay. He did the work. He opened up the cut. Now it's on him to continue down the path and make the ringside position come in here to try to stop this fight. All right, there's that switch kick, DC. He switches his feet really fast, sees the reaction from his opponent, then chooses where he's going to land the strike. Well, just as he did in the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes. And a good sign, too, doesn't succeed. Big strike lands. Big strike lands. Now he looks to try to chase down that finish. He's hurting him bad, man. That right hook is nasty. Well, not much set up behind it. The right hook misses. Business, but I'm not sure they're going to be able to do much with that cut. It continues to widen with every passing strike. And you're fighting a great fighter. It's hard to deal with the damage of the cut while dealing with the level of the fighter in front of you. Right now, you've got to do something different to try and change the way that this fight is playing out. Well, as my favorite rap group Onyx would say, stick and move, right? Uh, Beautiful slip off the center line there. Yeah, what a great job of moving his head. It doesn't take much to avoid a punch. World of trouble now. They say the straight moves are the ones that get there first, and it got right to the target. Distance management 101, another punch lands. And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. Oh, beautiful straight right hand. He does everything so well, and he's so calm. He's so calm in the face of such a big spot. Takedown defense holds up. Oh, he did a great job of rotating him into an underhook. Lee's got a nasty bruise, Daniel. You see it appearing there on the left side. You gotta think all of that body investment by his opponent is gonna pay large dividends as this fight continues. Oh, he's had a huge strike right there. I'm not sure how many more of these his opponent can take. Massive shot that he landed. Great job. It's a good right hand right there. Oh, big left. Let's go. Circling to his right. Sidekick. 90 seconds to go. Oh, he lands another strike to the body here. Really starting to connect on a lot of strikes to the midsection here in the latter stages of this fight. Well, you Oh, man, DC, he would appear to be in real trouble. Oh, look at that. Nice feedback right hand, my goodness. Just misses with that one. Under a minute now to go. What a great fight. Damage doled out on both sides. Perhaps some bonus money coming the way of these two individuals at 19. 50K, baby. Somebody's getting paid. These two guys are doing a great job in a fight that is so competitive.
that is so evenly matched. These two really will be proud of the effort that they have shown inside the octagon. Beautiful little hook. Oh, hook shot blocked there by Lee. 20 seconds left. Tried to go to the body, but unable to connect. Oh, beautifully timed with the Superman punch. Right. Buzzer sounds for the end of round four, 20 minutes in the books. All right, we're going to stay with him and follow him back to the corner to the stool because that is a really severe cut that he is dealing with. We'll see if the cut man can stem the bleeding here. Don't be stupid. All right, and being told we've got some replays from the previous round, and it appears as though the cut on the bridge of the nose is getting worse by the minute. It's getting worse by the minute, and he's got an opponent in front of him that wants to target it. He wants to hit him on the nose over and over again. I wonder if every time he gets hit there, the blood goes down into the mouth, making it difficult to breathe. You ready to fight? Ready. Fifth and final round. Right, next round is now underway. DC, any major takeaways after the previous five minutes? That both of these guys are very evenly matched. The matchmakers did a fantastic job when they put these two in the octagon. So even though it wasn't crazy, you got to see high-level mixed martial arts. Beautiful level change. Make him think he's going low and it's right over the top with that beautiful overhand. Great punch. Look for him to throw that overhand here again. Man, these guys have some chins on them. Huge shots being landed on both sides. Back to the well with that right hand. It's no good. Well, you thought the cut man did his job, but that cut on the nose is just nasty, and it is pouring blood now. Heavy kick downstairs. Lee's hook shot is blocked. Saw that coming from a mile away. Straight punch there again. Been there all night. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high with his opponent, thought he was going low. And now he's got him hurt very badly. Well, when you're dealing with a cut like that, it may not be long before it starts to impact the breathing. Not a good spot to be in here. Oh, roundhouse kick lands. Just over three minutes now to go in the fight. And once again, looking for that highlight reel KO with that front kick. Well, this fight has been absolutely crazy. Both fighters continuing to target the head and the face of the other. I feel like we're going to get like an ambulance pick with these two guys later. Tonight. Yeah, they are both beat up. They are both unwilling to take a step back. They are both wearing the damage, but both okay with it in order to have a good, fun fight. All right, it's late in the fight now. I don't need to be a judge to tell you that he is clearly losing. What is a fighter's man? Maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Martial arts, folks, this is absolutely crazy. Both fighters dealing with critical damage and cuts. There's blood everywhere. Fan Two minutes now to go in this one. Let's go. One, two, high kick. Just misses with the jab there. Both fighters start to open up a little bit. Oh, and he lands yet another knee. And sometimes it pays to be the taller fighter, DC. I know you can't necessarily relate. Oh! Power shots landing on both sides. And the chins continue to hold up. Lee's 
really bleeding something fierce now. That cut is not getting any better. Big power shot there. Man, his sidekick is just killer. You saw it right there. He has a really good sidekick. Just a gorgeous shot to end the fight right there. I'm not even sure the opponent really saw it coming. So back to the drawing board for him. But for the winner, this is certainly exactly what he was looking for here tonight. Bruce Buffer now with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 10 seconds of round number five. Declaring the winner by knockout and still the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Bruce the Dragon. Mixed martial arts royalty, folks. Bruce Lee, lighten up your living room tonight and giving this capacity crowd a whole lot to cheer about. You know he's gonna get everyone's best shot, but more often than not,